What's going on guys? It's your boy Andy Arts and today I'm gonna be talking about my Samsung Galaxy Book 3 laptop and I'm also going to review this new little mini RGB keyboard that I have been liking very much. So this keyboard I got it from Amazon is about $10, $12 with taxes, right? Really cool. It's a QWERTY keyboard. It's got everything you need here. And it's got a mouse touchpad. This is really cool. I'm going to show you guys how to use it and its features and all that cool stuff. And uh, we're going to have fun with this. I've actually also been using it with uh, Clip Studio Pro as an artist. So, yeah. Um, let's go ahead. Let me go ahead and show you guys how it's done. So, first things first, let's go ahead and turn this bad boy on. Let's go ahead and turn it on. And it lights up. Light up, baby. All right, so now let's go ahead and we're going to start out with the mouse, right? With the mouse or the, the little keypad. This is to control the mouse. So I'm going to going to touch the keypad. Actually, let me bring it up. All right, so where's the key? Where is it? Where is it? All right, so there it is, right? So, right, so it's, hopefully you guys can see that, but there's the little cursor, right? Here's the keypad, and I'm going to move it. See, wherever, wherever I tell it to go, it goes. All right. And I'm controlling it. I'm controlling it. I'm controlling it. And then, of course, it's got the little right click or the, the right click and left and left click buttons right here. So this is left click, right click, right. Or you can also just like, you know, you can also just tap on the on the what you call it on the keypad on the pad right so i'm gonna tap it let's see what it does All right so the cursor's right there i'm gonna tap it no it's not doing anything all right hold on uh dang it hold on a second guys oh yeah so it's also this button here you guys can see there's also this button here where you can like right click it right so so this button here this also they had this a right click button here and a left click button here if you guys can see so it's got pretty much everything and then of course um hold on then of course here it's got a play button for video and then um it's got a play button for video and a volume button of course Got a volume button right here, and I'm gonna go ahead and click. So, see, the little volume shows up. It's at a hundred. Um, one of the great things I like about this is using it with Clip Studio, right? And actually, I'm gonna go ahead and open Clip Studio right now. Let's go ahead and use our handy dandy pen. Right, and um, because I think, especially when you're using when you're using this tablet, when I fold this tablet, I can't use the I can't use the, the, the this keyboard because I fold it right. This is a 360, right? So then that's why I need this keyboard. So when I fold it, I still have a keyboard to use, right? Oh, and by the way, I forgot to I forgot to tell you guys. So this you connect it to your computer with a little um with a, uh, what do you call this? The, with a little USB connector, right? Um so let me show you. So I'm going to open up a file here. Let's just say, I don't know, any file. What was I working on recently? Something I was working on recently, let's say, um, Kid Goku. I was recently working on this, right? And what I do is, to I mean, I, I'm holding the phone, but to quickly switch, right? I'll click on the pen, the P. Ah, oh, crap. Hold on. I'll click on the P for the pen. Right? And it gives me the pen right away. And I can just, you know, click. <clears throat> I'll click on the E for the eraser. The E for the eraser right here. Click E. Gives me the eraser. And then I, you know, use this. So it, it works great for Clip Studio. It helps you, like, switch. And because the buttons are small and, it, you know, it fits all in your hand, you can kind of, like, click on things much, much faster. So it really helps you work, work much faster. 
it really helps you work much, much, much faster. So it's really cool. Really, really cool. And also, let's play some video. Actually, let me open up Netflix. I'm going to show you how to um, how it works with video. That's good. Cool. You can see uh, it sizzle. As a matter of fact, let me use this. Wait, darn it. At one point, his tongue swelled up so much that he... All right. Sorry, that was the video playing. All right, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and use the keyboard here. And I'm going to click on, let's watch the Wolf of Wall Street. Well, reason for the call today, All right, John, let's go ahead and click on the Wolf of Wall Street. All right. So right here is playing. You can see it play. And I'm going to skip, actually. Let me skip over to, um, I don't know, something over here. All right. And I'm going to click on the play button. It stops, right? I'm clicking on the play button. And then I'm going to click it again. It starts playing again. Stop. Play. Stop. Play. And if I want to fast forward it, to fast forward, you hit the right button on this side. Right? So that I'm going to fast forward. Fast forward. It, it skips like five, I think like five, ten seconds. Yeah, ten seconds. And I'm going to click back. Ten seconds, ten seconds, ten seconds. So this is absolutely amazing. So, and so see how far I am from the computer, right? It works up for about up to like 10 feet. Once you go past like 10 feet, it's, it's gonna, the first thing that goes like the keyboard and then the uh, RGB, uh, the little RGB uh, um, features here. And one last thing before we go, because I really do like this, um, this little device. Uh, let's work on the, RGB settings. So if you want multicolor, if you want to change the colors, you can click on the FN and then on the uh, F2. See the little blue gear, right? So you got to hold the FN button and then click on the F2, right? And then it changes colors. Oh my God, look at that. Blue, white, red. Uh, I'm more of a red type of guy. So yeah, this is absolutely fantastic i love this little keyboard it works wonders and i'm gonna keep using it so um all right and whatever you guys uh whatever you guys think about this review my little keyboard and my little samsung uh, laptop i got two laptops now got a bunch of computers here now uh i should really be like an it guy but I'm not. <laughs> all right dude so that's gonna be it for this video thank you for watching and especially, I recommend this if you are a digital artist. This is a nice little shortcut. If you're like, if you're drawing and, and you know, and you got a digital tablet, uh, this is, this works great because it just, it, you know, it's just easier to click on things and it gives you a lot of shortcuts and it's just great. And it's also great if you, you know, if you want to be away from your computer, this works as a nice remote. As a matter of fact, let's go ahead and play Netflix. And it is playing and pause right so mini key mini rgb keyboard uh, i'm gonna try to put a link in the description so you guys can go and get it at amazon.com i saw some timu but on Tim, the problem with timu is i think on timu they give you the one that has like that uses batteries this one uses uh this one is usb charge so you don't need batteries for this all right guys make sure to like this video make sure to comment below tell me what you think and subscribe to the channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell for future notifications. It's your boy, Andy Arts, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.